Hey guys, uh, Dipesh from Cricket Store Online um, and Crick Max. Today, uh, <clears throat> as you guys are aware, we got lots and lots and lots and lots of uh, bats from Kukubura. Of course, we got the Gun and More, the full shipment, entire, every single range. Kukubura, uh, unfortunately, we were not able to get uh, the full container load over because there, there were space constraints and, you know, they were basically asked us to wait a few more weeks or a couple more weeks um, but we couldn't wait for the bat so you know what we just airlifted the bats uh, paid paid uh, arm and leg for the shipping and logistics nowadays unfortunately but you know what we had to do it we had to do it for you guys so anyway today um, I'm doing a video on ghost pro uh, and then I'll probably do the second video too if the time permits uh, there is a there is a new model um, for the big bats, that's a very popular bats from Kokobura series. Um, it's called a big ghost. So um, we'll we'll get that. Uh, you know, if you guys remember, there were big Kahuna, there were Obstein. Those were the huge, huge, huge bats, oversized bats. Um, so this year they have unrolled a big ghost bat. The ghost bat has been very, very successful series since they launched. I believe about four years ago, if I'm not wrong. Um, and they have been very, very amazing bats altogether. So, uh, you know, they had added a big ghost version of it to it. But anyway, today uh, in this video, I'm going to talk about Kahuna Pro. Let me just get that um, and then open the box for you. Just take the couple of balls because uh, yesterday I saw Amar uh, doing the video and losing all the balls and at least he had a help. Today, I don't have a help here. So I need to be precise uh, and make sure I... Uh, <laughs> middle of the balls whether it's uh, on the bottom or whether it's uh, it's in the uh, somewhere else I, I hope you guys can see uh, me opening the box I think you guys are good um, okay so these are ghost pro uh, woo! Wow um, the first bat I got in the hand is it's very abnormal to what Kokobura does for their pro or grade one bats in terms of the number of grains but i guess uh, they heard us because we did ask for some more grains uh, this this year uh, requested that see if you guys can find a cleft and reserve it for us um as you guys are also aware the Kokobura is made by sg as you guys are aware right um so when i was in the factory i had a couple of words and i had asked uh, and requested not even asked I, I must say requested that to see if i get a um you know better grading uh, more grains on the at least top top end bats however i do like the way they make their bats the way they press it uh because i went and i did took a tour because they have a it's the same factory however it's a different section because kukuburo bats are made uh, slightly different than the way sg bats are made uh, so they have a separate setup, uh, separate craftsmen uh, who makes their bats, the sep separate pressing. And I'll, I will talk about the pressing a bit more uh, as uh, Amar was telling you guys about the round face. I like to keep it very simple, uh, round face. Um, and that kind of takes uh, about a couple of mm's away from the edges when you round the face and the, round the edges. Uh, but I think that's the proper way of doing it because that's an English way of doing it. Um, because if you look at the English made bats, they are all like that. Um, gun and more, for example. So anyway, uh, without wasting any more time, um, I got the uh, Ghost Pro Cricket Bat right here in my hand. Um, if you look at it, uh, this year, they got the hint of blue here to, to their aesthetics. Uh, the Kukubura sticker is a bit um, embossed, so you feel it. It's really nice. Um, and... Uh, right here and then the traditional kokoburo symbol is there that's great uh this is a pro branding that's also a little bit of embossing and here a little bit of embossing here as well um overall it's a really really nice uh stickers um talk about the grain on this bat as you guys can see is beautiful superb um one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven grains very 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 clean face um again on the bottom uh, on the back it does follow the same way um on the back uh not really uh issues but yeah looks good no i mean i thought this was a blemish but there is a it, 
this is normal uh, natural wood but uh, overall a uh, nice bat it feels and picks up like what i like guys uh, woo. wow 27 feel uh, and pick up 2.7 picks up really nice and light the if you guys can look at the shape um sorry guys uh just a lot of boxes here so the handle is semi oval on this one uh, normal size handle i wouldn't say it's, it's extra thick or extra thin normal size handle i like it this way semi oval uh if you look at the profile it's a mid mid profile mid to i wouldn't say low but mid to low slightly uh not not a mid here like uh ca bats but it's like a mid here which is traditional uh, player profile a lot of player profile uses a lot of players uses this profile pretty much of course some of them have a duck build or a shave off from here like traditional ss bats uh, but they have a spine kind of going somewhere around here which is good um and uh, overall i mean i do like the feel of the bat uh one thing i must say the kokobura does an amazing job at uh branding um, there are stickers uh, and everything is very very stylish even they oh, even here i don't know if you guys can read this they do say stylish here but they are very very stylish when it comes to designing um they are probably uh i wouldn't even say one of the best they're probably the best company when it comes to designing even if you look at their soft goods even if you look at their kit bags even their shoes they spend a lot of time um and, and money in going into designing of their products and that's why i really really like the designing and branding on their on their products um let me just quickly weigh this bat all right so it's about 2.8 so it's 2.82 um I, I got this sticker will take it off but so about 2.8 uh exact probably weight on this feels like 2.7 um quickly uh do a, doing a ping let's see if i can do it better than Amar or if i'm gonna lose the ball oh i'm be i'm careful wow guys this ping's really nice oh man these boxes darn this boxes sorry <laughs> wow amazing ping amazing ping guys um this is a red ball semi new ball wow look at that a uh, little bit the new red ball wow really good um very good ping that's bat number one for you guys uh i'll now quickly go through the bat number two um uh, and and i guess i think we got eight i don't know we got quite a bit honestly uh because again these has been the one of the best selling bats Yep, so they're back to their normal in the bat number two, eight grains. But again, look at the clean face, nice and clean face, equal distance grain. And this is what a lot of pro prefers. Pro wants grains between six and eight, guys. Not even kidding. Uh, I know a lot of grain is a myth in the market, but pro likes six to eight grains back uh, because they last them long. They don't want the bats to last because they, they hit pretty a lot of balls right in the nets and everything. They don't want their bats to crack up and break because... You know they're very superstitious about getting used to their bats and all those good stuff so really nice um uh look at that good 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 very same profile that we looked at uh just a quick ping video Ooh. guys very nice really really good ping on this one as well i mean the first one was definitely good this one even even again even eight grains it pings as good as the first one all right okay so bat number three and i'm gonna line them up so i'll, I'll probably put it uh i'll probably mark them as well so if you guys are online and asking for it i'm gonna just line it up so bat number one two and three so one two three four five six seven eight nine all right so nine nice and straight grains as you guys can see uh really nice profile uh the concave wise uh, is a very minimal concave not not that much very minimal but again that's how the ghost shape has been uh, over the years again pickup wise oh man 2.7 2.7 
um i think the weight of that i think it has to be yeah uh, weight is 2.8 picks up about ounce lighter on this so this one is 2.8 as well that's bat number three i'll weigh the bat number two as well let's see so bat number two was 2.83 uh, so they're right now they're all pretty much uh, 2.8 which is great so that's bat number three for you guys And you know what, Kukubura has the covers. They haven't caught up to the fancy covers like other manufacturers, but it's okay. I'm happy as long as their product, their designing is top notch. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. This one is nine consistent grains, as you guys can see. Very nice, uh, consistent profile, which is good. And that's what, yeah. 2.6 and half ish 2.7 the pickup wise yeah uh, however the weight is 2.84 so again 2.8 range uh, nice Ooh. all right the ping on this one guys i think it's slightly better than the first two i haven't i think i didn't do the ping on the third one wow Guys, this definitely is better than first two. Let me see the the third one. I didn't I didn't do it. Uh, oh man! Wow. Yeah, I would say third and fourth one are very similar. Uh, very similar in the ping. Uh, but I think the fourth one seems and sounds a little bit more softer. Uh, I like that. That's just that's just me. Um, so that's bat number. Four, so that's three. I'll just probably line them up so I don't uh, mix them up. So that's bat number four for you guys. You know, sometimes a lot of people ask us like, why, why you don't, why do you get like, you know, seven, eight, nine, ten bats uh, of each each model. Um, you know why why not wait and 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 buy like two or three sell them get another one you get a fresh stock out of it um and the, our philosophy is a little different uh we don't want to get one or two uh at the same time because we want to get the bats made out of the same batch um and there is a downside <laughs> if the batch is bad then oh well our luck however we have not um gotten stuck with the bad bats in in, in many years honestly uh touch wood because our manufacturers knows uh you know how much we value quality uh when we go out there and when we talk to them we all we talk about is quality we never talk about price um of course price is important to the end customer but again quality also has the same value in everybody's mind so um so we get we get it because we want to give you guys our customer options on how much can you how many bats you can pick from you know we also want to see the consistency right okay is the is the is the bat are being consistent in terms of the shape like i, I have looked at this is a fifth bat um and the shape wise is very very consistent I, I have not seen something oh the sweet spot is a little bit up here or the bottom the weight is is very uh very high or very low the balance is very off because i want to see the bat is being consistently made yeah, about 2.7, guys. Again, on this one, let's see quickly. Wow, wow. I think, guys, I, I, one thing I must say, the pressing on these bats is phenomenal. Um, and I do like those, uh, I do like this type of pressing better because I like round face a lot. Um, because it, it actually has a lot of wood there, which, which, they are, which they are pressing. So, of course, you're going to get that obvious, that punch out of it. However, what you do is you compromise on the edge size. Like all of these bats, uh, if I if I look at it, the edge size is about 36, 37 mm. Uh, the spine is good. Spine is about 64-ish uh, mm, which, which is good as well. But you're losing about 2 mm of edge because you're doing the round face and the round edges as, as opposed to keeping the sharp edges. When you keep the sharp edges, 
of course it's more prone to breakage um so but i do like uh, round face and round edges because it gives you that better punch and better feel when you're tapping the ball even when you're hitting the ball um i'm a big fan of the um round or semi round face um as opposed to the flat face but again they'll perform the same way eventually uh however it's just a personal preference but i i i prefer this and that's why kukabura has been uh, one of the top brand um we have at cricket store online because you know the quality that they have been going through the maintain the uh, the, the, the way they maintain it uh because a lot of times people ask for can i get 20 grains bat or 15 grain bats or 30 grain bats right um kukabura's answer is very very normal that okay our pro grade bats will always have 8 to 10 grains you're lucky you'll get 12 um and we have been lucky for with one bat in this batch however it's a 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 about 9 grains on this so consistently 8 to 9 grains we are getting this is bat number 5 guys um so the ping is amazing on number 3 4 and 5 it's it's very 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 good on the number 1 and 2 uh but again it's just just uh, the way i feel over they are very consistent i would say it's about 95 to 100 so it's about maybe uh you know 3 to 5 point here and there which doesn't matter honestly because once you knock the bat in is they're all going to feel feel good and uh, the good part is or the good thing that i like about it is all of them are very consistent very very close uh, i i haven't i have not seen a dead bat yet um often times i do see dead bat when i when i do and look at the batches of hundreds and hundreds of bats when i go to the factory um okay again 27 i would say 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 uh and 9 so the so 9 grains on this one uh, slightly grain you can see it on the edge but 9 grains on this one as well uh feels uh, and picks up about uh 27 ish whoa what is this very nice guys i don't know if you guys can see it and hear it amazing thing that's bat number 6 for you guys wow so it's 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 crazy honestly it's crazy because most of these bats are amazing thing i it's hard for me to see which one is the best out of the 6 i have reviewed so far uh, i want to wait uh, quickly guys okay 2.8 even the weight they have kept gave me a very very consistent weight this time uh, on these willow which is which is amazing um because all of them have been pretty much under 2.8 or 2.7 i mean sorry not 7 2.82 uh, or 2.83 all of them have been under that um all right maybe i got a little heavier one here let's see let's see No, it feels about 2.8. Uh 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9. But I really like the grain structure on this guys. Look at this. 9 grains, very clean face, equal distance. It's doing the same thing on the back, it's following the same way and most of these bats guys it follows the same way. So no blemishes on the face. I really like this. Um but it feels at 2.8 on the pickup. Let's see how much it weighs on the scale. But uh, let's see ping. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ooh. All right, this Ghost Pro is giving me run for the money uh because each and every bat is pinging equally 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 same um which is great which is good for you guys cuz you know what you don't have to wait for that oh can i get number 5 bat or can i get number 2 bat or can i get because majority of them are pinging very 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 good now it all will come down to the the weight and the feel uh, even then um uh, one of the parents is waving me but weight and the feel he's waiting to get one of these back um so he knows I'm here so he wanted to uh pick one for uh his kid so I'll pick one for him um but uh, majority of these bats uh, the weight is is pretty much same is getting uh, in the scale of uh, 2.8 oh i need to weigh the number 6 so one second guys Oh, okay. 
If all right, so the pickup wise, it picks up the same as its weight. It's about two point eight, uh, eight one to be precise. Um, so all of these bats, so far seven bats, guys, they all weigh two point eight, two point eight three or four. Uh, majority of them being closer to two point eight. Uh, that's amazing. So very consistent weight, very lightweight. Uh, that's what we want. Wow, this even feels lighter. Yeah, picks up about two seven, two six. Eh, not exact six, but maybe a little bit higher end of a six. Two seven, I would say. Let's see the ping. Ooh, nice. Good. So this one. So I wouldn't. I guess I looked at the eight bat so far, um, and I think this one probably pings. Uh, below most of this, I would say. Uh, but again, it's a, it's a good pinging bat, but again, I saw other bats which are better, but the top seven were very, very, very consistent. I would say, if I were to rate uh, in what percentile, right? Uh, they were all in 98 percentile, 9800 percentile, whatever. This one probably is like 90th percentile. So there is definitely a difference of uh, those uh, six, seven points um, difference. But uh, yeah, let's see, I'm gonna check out the red ball. Ooh, red one is performing better than the white. Let's see another red ball. Yeah, red one is uh, a little crispier. Um, but let's see, let's see the weight on this one. All right, so this one's actually I felt lighter. However, this one is close to 2.85. Uh, so a little bit, yeah. So that's uh, bat number eight for you guys. So I'll mark these bats uh, for all of you guys uh, just now. But uh, thank you for watching. Uh, appreciate, give us feedback because uh, it means a lot to us. Um, it helps us improve uh, and we'll keep bringing you best. Thank you, take care.